vlog. Hi, I am about to go out to a cafe. I need to do a lot of work. <laughs> Quite a few things planned that I need to get done. One of them being a lot of content editing for the vlog. Also creating TikToks. I was not creating any TikToks really last week. Just because yesterday I was so swamped with all the studio sessions and I can even hear it in my voice. My voice needs more vocal rest. I have to also rehearse because I have a show on Saturday. Um, it's going to be a cute little, I think like 20, 25 minute set. Um, it's an outdoor concert. There's a lot of other artists on the lineup who are going to be playing their music. It's going to be like a fun good summer vibe. I think it'll be fun. Um, try not to stress out about any of this, but like there is a lot to get done. I am forcing myself to go outside because I have not gone outside. Losing my sanity. I can feel today and yesterday like not mentally super happy. So trying to pick it back up because we got shit to do. So I will see you at the cafe. Okay. Love you. I don't know where I'm going yet. Bye. So this is the outfit. Um, haven't worn this tennis skirt in forever. I don't even remember the last time I wore it, but I just didn't really feel like wearing pants today. And the shirt doesn't super match, but I, whatever. We're rolling with it. We're going. Okay. Bye. Okay. Here's the update. Hi. <laughs> It is um, 9.25-ish, and I did a lot since I last saw you. I walked over to the cafe, was walking distance, half a mile-ish, and then had a really good time. The coffee was good, got a lot of work done because I also got to finish editing my vlog that will go up tomorrow, which is really nice, and then walked back home, filmed a bunch of content, which was good. I needed to do that. Also rehearsed my set. I ran through it once. I figured out some things that I wanna maybe go back to tomorrow and just fine tune. And then I was like, okay, I'm gonna take photos. So I put on like my lashes and everything, which they can now come off. Thank you very much. Um, it just didn't work out. It really didn't work out. And it makes me kind of sad because sometimes like, I don't know, I get this thing in my head where I'm like, oh my God, if I didn't take a good photo, whatever, then that means like I'm ugly. Dumb as hell. Like what the heck? It just didn't work out. Like, um, the lighting took, <laughs> I wanted to get a picture at nighttime, like in the dark, flash, digicam, blah, 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 blah. Like that's the vibe. But it just didn't look good. I didn't like how I looked. I didn't like the angles. It didn't get dark until way later than I thought it would. I would get, I thought it would get dark around like eight. It really was not dark until closer to nine. And then the outfit just didn't look right outside. I don't like it. So I came back up. Try to do some like shots in my apartment, see if that would look good. And like, they're not terrible photos. I'll put some of the photos, but I don't think I'll post them. And then I didn't get my full 10,000 steps in. Technically I did because I'm not holding my phone all the time that I'm walking. Every time I rehearse, I'm not holding my phone or anything, but I'm like walking around, jumping, whatever. So in order to fulfill the 10,000 steps on my phone, I just went to the gym um, and did a quick little walk. And yeah, now I am so tired. Feeling a little bit, I don't want to say defeated. I'm trying to keep a good mindset about the fact that like, hey, you tried to take photos. It didn't really work out this time. The vision wasn't 100% executed the way you wanted it to. That's fine. Like there's going to be other times you can take photos, like chill out. I don't know. I put so much pressure on myself, you know? And then the other part of it is my camera is like dying. So my camera has died. I don't know why I don't just charge it. Like I'm going to charge it tonight or tomorrow morning when I wake up because um, the light at night sometimes bothers me. But yeah, I don't know. I'm just rambling now, but all that to say, like being perceived, uh, filming content, like taking photos, it sounds so silly and it's just something I, I, number one, I do enjoy doing it. Like I have a vision, I want to execute it, but it's frustrating when that doesn't come to fruition in the way that you would hope. And like, I take it really personal on myself and I'm like, Bleh. whatever. It's all noise. It's done. It's okay. We're moving forward. That's a healthy mindset, right? I don't know. I definitely am in a better place than I was five hours ago, though. So that is an improvement. And I will see you tomorrow. I don't know for what, but I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Love you. Good night. Hello. I'm about to go in for a studio session. I not really had the best week. Just mentally, emotionally, very exhausted <laughs> feeling very hopeless and like sad and like unable to do anything except like lay in bed and watch tiktoks and stuff that i don't even really want to watch um so that's just kind of been weighing on me i'm really 
hoping that this is a good studio session. I really am so close to finishing this EP thing and I'm very excited to be in that stage, but also, I don't know, just the weight of the fucking world, which is not, should not even be on my shoulders. Like, I don't know why I'm putting all this like pressure from not even just finishing the EP or whatever, but just fucking existing right now. I don't know, whatever, whatever. I'm gonna go to the studio session. I'm gonna try to vlog and I will see you after. Okay, love you. And you're not in it, so don't worry. <laughs> Whoa, I'm good. Oh, oh my god. It's different for me. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. So yeah, I'm gonna build on the social. Uh, I can double that. Uh, okay, same spot. I'll do just more on the social. Uh, shit. Um, <laughs> on the higher ones that we were just doing, can I hear just uh, double two, three? Double two. This one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I hear that? Both of these? Uh, whichever, just solo. Yeah. Okay, I'll do the top ones again then that I just did because I don't want too much of the same note. Yeah, that's yeah, better. I like that. Oh, okay. <laughs> What's the lower harmony that I have there? Just stay with me. Oh, okay, wait. I'm gonna try doing it. Stay with me, stay with me. Um, I'll sing it again. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> Let's just stay with me. Yeah. Oh, actually, I'm gonna do something different. Let's just stay with me. Oh, I like that. Yeah. <laughs> actually, can we comp that with the other one? I don't love how it's. Huh? It should be. Huh? You know oh, I see. So I like how in the beginning there's more weight to that. You know what? I like it. That's fine. She was struggling in that moment anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'll turn this off. Uh, I'm not going to hit my head this time. <laughs> okay. Cool. I just finished the session. I feel so much better. So, so much better. I feel like, number one, I have a purpose <laughs> in my life, in my existence. Um all of that so that is very healing also i was so worried that this song was going to take like extra time just because my next studio schedule studio session wasn't scheduled until sunday and then the one after that wasn't until later on and it was just like i want to be able to get this ep out right and have everything done and not having it done was stressing me out but we pretty much finished i would say like 85 percent of the song like the lead the harmonies everything and i feel so much better about where it is and I don't know, I go into every session like hoping for the best, you know, hoping that things will just come to me and that I'll be able to like be in the moment and be able to trust my instincts um, when it comes to a lot of the stuff since, you know, a lot of the harmonies, ad libs, none of that is really pre-planned. Like I might have an idea, but when it comes to executing, I execute in the studio, you know? And so hoping for the best and then just kind of seeing what happens, but I really feel like it's in a good spot and so I'm really happy about that. I'm just a little bit stressed about the mixing and mastering of everything. I would say because that's the one thing that I truly cannot touch. Like I don't know how to do it. It would be a train wreck if I tried. Like there would be nothing good that could come out of that. So essentially I have to trust that someone else can help me execute my vision. And so finding that person right now is kind of what I'm trying to do. Because I think the person that I've been working with, I really enjoy working with them. I'm just trying to explore other producers and talent as well. And just seeing, you know, what's going to mesh best. What's going to help elevate this track to a place where I feel like, I don't know. I feel like this is some of the, this is the best that I've this is the most fun, most um, focused, I would say, body of work that I've done ever, which is not necessarily saying a lot because my discography isn't huge, you know, it's very small, but I would say that because this is like a project and because these songs are so near and dear to like the shit that I've been going through and I feel like it's really... I think it's pretty good. I want to hear it at its best that it possibly could be. Do you know what I'm saying? So that added pressure is like sitting in the back of my mind. Um, I have errands to run. I don't know which ones I'm going to run first. Actually, you know what? I have to drop off a Depop package at USPS. I also maybe need to go to Sephora. I keep like running out of things at odd times and then needing to refill them. I should have just refilled. Whatever. So I have that. I also need to finish my 10,000 steps. And I think I need to go to the grocery store. I don't know. It's just a lot. It's Friday though. I have a show tomorrow though. Every time I get out of the seat, I feel so good. And then reality sets back in and it like hurts. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. That's enough of that. Cut cut the cameras. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye. Can't sleep, can't eat, can't
I'm all dressed. I'm ready. Finally. I took forever to decide what the fuck I was gonna wear. Still don't know if I love it. I think it's fine. It's fine for now. A little chaotic because I was trying to do like a TikTok get ready with me for a show, blah, 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 blah. But I am excited. I was actually super nervous at soundcheck because I was feeling out the vibe and I was like, this is actually very like nature, acoustic, set, energy, like maybe my songs, like maybe I need to change my set list. I was talking to the guy um, who's going to like DJ and cue things up for me. I was like, is it too late to send you other stuff? Should I change? He was like, honestly, I think you're good. Like, you know what? Just be proud. Like, this is your music. Like, just do it. And I was like, you know what? Okay, so am I still a little bit nervous? Yes, um, but I think we're just going to go with the energy, see how it all pans out. Um, I need to fix my makeup in the car, whatever. It should be good. It's warm outside today, which is wonderful. I feel like I just want to go into this being present and just take it for what it is. It's a fun outdoor little concert series with a bunch of other performers. It's going to be a good time, and I will see you there. Love you. Bye. Dog right in the eye when I did that. Okay. Hi, it's Sunday. I didn't get to check in after the show yesterday, but it was amazing. Like, such a fun time. The performers were all so good, so sweet. I had so much fun. I was so grateful that my brother and my friends were able to come. And I got to meet so many cool people who are also in like music or production. All these super creative things and always that like lights up my soul. And so it was really fun to perform outdoors too. I think, like I said, like I was kind of worried about my set being too, uh, I don't know. I don't even know what I was worried about. It was fun. I played and I had a really good time. So definitely shout out to Musen. And I think they're going to try to do more. So hopefully I can go to those in the future. And even if I'm not performing, just like support and be part of it. Because um, I really enjoyed it. Today I am right outside of the studio. I will be going in and finishing the EP. That is the goal for today. I have three hours total. I don't think, honestly, I'll need a full three hours. Because we're just finishing up the last track um, and there's like a couple little harmonies that I'll probably put on to polish it off a couple of ad-libs I think I'm gonna change one of the lyrics just because I was thinking on it the other day and I was like that is not the right lyric that's not what I want there blah 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 blah, blah. doing all that and am I excited nervous like honestly I don't know I really don't know like this EP is giving me stress but also the most joy I've had and this has been such a tumultuous past couple months for me that like this EP has been the one consistent thing that like, oh my God, I wrote and recorded this EP in the past two months, truly. Cause I was thinking about it and I wrote the first song about a week after my breakup and it's been pretty much two, two and a half months since then. Wow, okay, I didn't realize that, that's kind of crazy. Um, yeah, I've been working really hard on this really hard and it's something like I can't wait to share and the fact that I have to wait even a little bit longer like at least probably a month before the full thing can come out like is scary it makes me a little bit anxious because I wish I could just I don't know I do want to take my time with it though. I, I don't know there's all, all these thoughts in my head but I'm just gonna go in and try to like just trust the process and trust myself because I think part of me is like okay you have three hours like you could just spend that time like tweaking every other song that you did for this EP but the the whole point is not to nitpick and be like a perfectionist. Okay, no, that's, that's not what I meant. I meant, 
I want it to be per perfect. There's all these things where I think it's more of like a spiritual thing at this point for me and an emotional thing rather than like let's try to think through every single fucking thing because I think thinking will lead me to a lot of overthinking possibly probably and so that's where I'm at I'm gonna go inside now I will see you in there okay love you. bye so this will be totally yeah I'll do one there uh, I'll do it one more time Um, I actually, at that little snap, I was doing a harmonies there. Gotcha. Just okay. <laughs> cool, that's fine then, <laughs> yeah. Cool, yeah, you can punch in for, um... Some of those. different harmonies in there. A lot of ad-libs, a lot of things. Mm -hmm.